It's the mounds of snow creating a mess. It's going to be nasty when everything melts. That's why Samfi Chin is trying to stay a step ahead. So we have to cut that guy, that guy, that guy. It's constant work all happening at Robert Boring's house. We got a wetland back there with uh, the water and all the snow. The tree started to lean towards the house. If there was more snow and it weighed down the tree, then it was definitely going to come down. So we just took care of it. As Samfi tackles one chore in the backyard, more hands are helping out front. I think about like an hour now we've been here. Robert knew the chainsaws were coming. Are we doing this whole area too? But he didn't expect the shovels. I was actually surprised that these guys came and did it. <laughs> this is two of my nephews. We just live around the corner. Automatically, they're probably here for some money. <laughs> That's what he thought. But nephew Tristan has a different reason. Do something nice. From the deck to the driveway, they clear snow and scatter de-icer. They may not be dressed to dig, but they do it anyway. Pretty much make a gateway so that all this water can get to the sewer before it freezes or anything else. It's the good deeds that just keep going. Let's we'll see if the neighbors need some help, nephew. I still need to show them my house too. <laughs> Across the street is where the cleanup continues. Excuse me? Would you guys like would you like some help? Another driveway in need of attention. Would you like in front of, in front here done too? At this house, the weather brought down branches that Samphy offers to pick up. I'll just come by tomorrow and grab these when we're on our way out. On this block, it's a big mess, but the neighborhood is digging out together. I think for everybody's cleanup time. In Lake Forest Park, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News.